My name is Reed Barber and I'm an Ole Miss engineer. My name is Rashad Collier and I am an Ole Miss engineer. My name is Amanda Nevins and I am an Ole Miss engineer. I chose Ole Miss because it was far enough from my hometown to broaden my horizon and give me the opportunities that I wanted. I chose Ole Miss because it really has a great reputation and uh, you can get a well-rounded education with uh, a beautiful campus and a great social life here. When I was started my college search, I just started looking at big schools uh, around where I was from. And so I came and visited Ole Miss and I just kind of fell in love with the town and the university itself. So it kind of found me. So I chose computer science because it's really been a hobby for me and it's actually an excellent field to go into and it's probably one of the biggest growing fields over the next 10 years. I chose computer science because computer science seemed the most interesting to me. It was, it was a major to where it wasn't all work and it wasn't all fun. It was a healthy balance of both and I really, really enjoyed that curriculum while I was here. I was always interested in math and problem solving and after my first semester I went and talked to the Dean Marnie Kendricks and she kind of directed me in the way of engineering and um, looking at the different types of engineering and she knew that I liked math so I took Java 111 the first class of computer science and it just kind of stuck. So. As far as my favorite class in total I'd have to as far as my favorite class in total, I have to go DMS 101. And that was introductory to digital media studies, which was a, which is a minor I'm pursuing. And that basically tells about all of the, of the digital forms of media that you can go in for, like video, audio, graphs, maps, things of that nature, and really teaching you in depth on how to use those things, so. My favorite class on campus so far has been Software Design 387. Uh, this is my favorite class because it actually put uh, real world computer science into uh, academics. So we were on a project group and we got to see all the different roles in um, agile development and uh, really prepared me for my internship uh, the following summer. So, My favorite class has probably been data science because it deals with using a lot of data to solve real, real world problems and you look at making algorithms that you can create a tangible conclusion from and it's really easy to see how it's used in the real world. This past summer I participated in an internship up in Memphis, Tennessee for FedEx uh, World Tech Headquarters. I was on a project group with four other people and kind of the same thing as our uh, class 387, software design. So we were given a project and we had to problem solve through it and find our roles and whatnot. And it really introduced me to uh, figuring out where I wanted to be in the tech field and not necessarily coding, but um, it has to be the people that manage the projects and are able to uh, write things down and document everything. So, so I did a co-op with the Department of Defense in Maryland and co-ops are an excellent way to get your foot into the real world and get a sneak peek of what uh, real work is going to be like. And it's an excellent opportunity to see what skills you need to work on when you get back to school and just kind of get a head start into the real world. I'm a part of the High Fidelity Environment Lab, which is in Kennard Hall with Dr. James Jones, like leading the whole program. And we basically do, when we basically research unity and things of 3D nature and virtual reality and augmented reality. So with that, it's a, it's a variance of programs and it's a variance of things that we have to do with that type of technology. And it's always just like a fun experience and it's always something new to do every day. So it's always a different research topic. So I plan on working for a defense contractor in Huntsville, Alabama named Dynetics and I'll be working on uh, different security related contracts with them. After graduation I'd like to gain a job somewhere in the state or bordering states. I've actually accepted a job with FedEx so come July I will be working uh, where I did my internship so it worked out.